Hello, this is Chris Menard. Let me show you how to create bookmarks in Adobe Acrobat Pro. If you need to, go, if you need to know how to go from Microsoft Word into Adobe Acrobat Pro, this is the video I've already made. So here we go in this tutorial. I have Adobe Acrobat Pro running. I have a PD. I have a document here. If you click over here, it says page thumbnails click right here it says bookmarks if you don't see this just expand it click here Microsoft Excel is a class uh, software application so I'm gonna make that a bookmark Excel one there's my Excel one training and we discuss I'm not gonna do every one of these I'm just gonna do a few If you wanted to change the name, you could just type over it. Okay, that's enough for Excel 1. Let's get down to Excel 2. Bookmark. Advanced formatting is covered in Excel 2, along with outlines and subtotals. And I could do 3, but I'm going to jump to Word. So Microsoft Word, highlight it, bookmark it. Then I have a Word Level 1, which I call Word Essentials. And I'm only going to do one in here. One more. So now we're ready. So we got everything bookmarked, uh, but it's not very organized because Excel is a main class. So I'm going to drag Excel 2 right here. Click. That's going to drop it exactly where it's at now. I'm going to move it just a tad to the right and indent it and drop it. I'm going to hold down, I'm, I'm, on, <coughs> I'm on the data, I'm going to hold down shift and click functions, drag them all at one time and put them under Excel level 1. And now, you can see where I'm headed with this, I can collapse and expand. So I would have Excel level 2, which is right here. So there's Excel level one, Excel level two, Microsoft Word, Essentials. Hold down the shift key again. And there we go. <coughs> I'm sorry, one thing I need to fix. Expand that. If you need, this is the easiest way to do this, because I've got a main topic and then one indent then a second indent, the way to fix this is to actually drag this and I always stick it right here and then pull this one up up above it. So now it's correct. And the last step is if you have a lot of bookmarks, usually you have a large document. When you send this to people that have Adobe Reader, you want them to, the bookmarks to automatically show up. So simply go to File, Properties, click Initial View. By default, you're on Description. Go to Initial View. And you want to make this Bookmarks Panel and Page. Hit OK. So when people open this with Adobe Reader, they'll see the bookmarks and obviously save it. So hopefully that helps you out with using bookmarks in Adobe Acrobat Pro. Thanks.